Yo, what's good, everyone? Welcome back to Skynet English. My name is Bruno, your official English teacher, you heard? So today's video, we're going to focus on slang words, more specifically, American slang words. Now, why should you learn this? Slang words are one of the things that takes your English to that next level, that takes you closer to reaching fluency, all right? Uh, the more slang you know, the easier it's going to be for you to talk to teenagers, for you to, to understand what's going on in some hip-hop musics and some rock songs, some hip-hop songs and some rock songs, you know what I mean? Um, this vocabulary is definitely going to make you feel much more comfortable if you are traveling through somewhere like New York. If you live in places like the Bronx, Queens, uh, Brooklyn... There's definitely some vocabulary that you need just basically to stay alive and to get something, to get the stuff that you want. You feel me? So we're going to talk about a couple of slang words in this video. And while you're here paying attention, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Drop us a like. Share your videos. I really, really appreciate it. All right. So let's go for the first one. The first one, number one, is ace. Ace. To ace a test is to get only good grades. Like, if you get 100% on a test, that means you aced it. Example, Jessica aced her English final exam. Her new teacher must be very, very good. Number two, A game. When you bring your A game, that means that you're doing the absolute best you can do. You're doing. You're you're using 100% of your energy. You're using 100% of your strategy. You are giving yourself to the project, heart and soul. That's why we say bring in your A game. So if you're bringing in your A game to a project, you have to dedicate yourself 100% to the project. All right. So we got one more. All nighter. All nighter. An all-nighter is when you basically stay up, wake the entire night doing something. Usually it's work or it could be it could be a party as well. But doing an all-nighter or sometimes as we say pulling an all-nighter, that means that you're going to be awake the entire night to get something done. All right? So check it out. Um, yeah, I pulled an all-nighter. For this last history test that we had, I studied throughout the night, you know, I started studying at 8 p.m. and I finished studying at 6.30 a.m. My class was at 7.15, so I had to jet, I had to book to the class, and I took the test, and hopefully all of that all-nighter work is going to pay off and I'm going to get a good grade. The next one is, are you kidding me? Now, this is used rhetorically or to express excitement or frustration. Example, man, I've been sitting in traffic for two hours and it only moved two feet. You got to be kidding me. This is probably the worst traffic jam I've ever been in. I right, yo, the next one is around the clock. I right, yo, I'm familiar with this one because I used to do this a lot growing up in New York. Around the clock means you're going to work 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You feel me? No time for sleep, no time for nothing. You got to be there from 12 in the morning till 12 in the morning the next day. You know what I'm saying? It's a full 24-hour circus that you have to do sometimes. So it's really tiring, but you usually get paid a decent amount of money. So I'll give you an example. There's a pizzeria by my crib that is uh, 24-7. They're open around the clock. So whatever time you're hungry, you can go over there, you can pick up your pizza, or they will even deliver it to your house. So that's slamming. Thank you guys so much. I hope all of y'all stay safe. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the channel, smash that notification bell button, start sharing these videos as much as you can. Um, and I'm going to be catching you 
weekly now, right? I'm making two or three videos a week now. I just haven't decided exactly which days they're going to drop, but trust me, they coming, all right? All right, people, that's it for today. I'm going to catch you all on the next video. Peace.